In this video, I'm going to explain to you what to do if you get that tire pressure light. First of all, I doubt it. I have any issues with my vehicle and uh, because it just got cold overnight. And uh, that's the reason why the pressure went down on my tire. So one thing I'm going to do is check the pressure and then come back to take a look if the light goes away on its own. Okay, so I'm going to take this and I'm going to put... Takes 40 PSI, but I'm gonna put 35 in here. Uh, I'm gonna put 37, okay? Cause it's gonna get hot again. So just a tiny bit amount. I'll check all four wheels. They're all down to like 36, 34. And I'll do the same thing in the back. Let's go to the back right here. If I can reach my line. There we go. Let's go to the other side. So that's all you need to do, okay? And especially in cold weather, the pressure is going to go down. You have to check every often. And when it gets hot, the pressure is going to, summertime, is going to go back up. And it's going to be more than normal. So you have to Undeflate the tires a little bit and bring the pressure down. And here's the last one. And then we'll go inside the car and see if the light goes away on its own. We shouldn't have to push anything. There you go. I ended up putting 40 in all four tires, 40 PSI. And now we're gonna go inside. All right, so I'm gonna take the camera just like this. We'll check on the dash. So it's probably gonna be, uh, need to be driven a little bit. And let's see if that light goes away on its own. So I'm gonna go for a spin and let's see how it goes. We shouldn't have to reset anything. So we still got that light in the dash. Let's go for a long drive around the block. Should go away in a momentarily. It's probably gonna take a cycle and the light should go away on its own. I'll probably shut the car off, let it sit for a little bit and come back to it and eventually the light should go away. It hasn't went away yet so far. It should detect unless my pressure is no good. So um, I'm gonna drive around. It should it should definitely go away on its own. I should not have to reset that light. There should be no reset for this tire system. Anyways, uh, I will update. I'm gonna let the car sit down and then I will come back and see what it does. So after shutting the car off and on and it just went away on its own. I didn't do anything, so I just checked the pressure. Okay, guys, uh, hopefully this video helps you guys out. Don't forget to subscribe, share, and like. And I just had the car sitting for like a little while outside.